guys what's going on welcome to serial at midnight my name is heath and in this video we're going to be unboxing this package that was sent to serial at midnight by producer david sterling of sterling entertainment i have no idea what's in here but i can tell you that sterling entertainment is the company behind the camp blood collection well the camp blood series as well as the camp blood you know i'll just just get this and show it to you. The Camp Blood Collection Blu-ray box set as well as the Axe Grinder Blu-ray box set. And it's so cool. If you're just joining us, if this is one, you know, if you haven't been watching all of these videos, uh, our review, our video review of the Camp Blood Collection is included as a bonus feature on the Axe Grinder Collection. So it's our disc debut. So I can also tell you that Sterling Entertainment is currently running a sale uh, this was a fourth of july sale it's after the fourth of july but the sale is still running as of the recording of this video right here so uh, i'm going to put the links to that sale in the description of this video you guys there's about a hundred items included in this sale dvds are 5.99 and blu-rays are 7.99 so if you are of the uh, independent horror persuasion this is a great time to stock up on some on some titles that you may have missed and if you do please tell them that uh, that cereal at midnight sent you. So, I have no idea what's in here. Uh, it seems like an appropriate time to break out the huge Bowie knife again. Although I have a long history of injuring. Did I just injure myself? No. Okay. I really probably shouldn't be messing around with that knife. Okay. Let's see. Oh, first thing is this flash drive. This USB flash drive. Wait. Let me take it out of here. So I can, there's so much crinklies. You want to do an ASMR video, guys? At this point, this video just becomes an ASMR. It's just, guys, this USB drive. USB, USB. <laughs> That's satire, by the way. We're not turning into a, an ASMR channel. This is, uh, this, uh, this killer, killer clown guy is branded Axe Grinder. Uh, Sterling Entertainment there on the back uh, it's got the Sterling Entertainment branding on it and this I believe this has at least one of the Axe Grinder movies in it on it in the highest definition possible I know with the Camp Bloods collection uh, it came with a flash drive as well but if you've seen that video I'm gonna link to that video right here also check the video description of, uh, of this video for all the pertinent links to all our Sterling Entertainment coverage but that came with a flash drive as well that had a 4k copy of the what is the most recent Camp Blood movie uh, in full 4K. So uh, I'm going to have to pop this in as soon as we finish. But this is very cool. This is not all that's in there, though. But I want to thank Mr. Sterling, if he's watching this, for sending this. Because I know um, it, it did not come with the Axe Grinder collection when I, when I got the Axe Grinder collection to review. So happy to have it. Okay, we got some discs in here. I feel like I could do a better job of opening this box. Let me see. Sorry for the, sorry for the noise. I'm just gonna tear it. Just gonna tear it. All right. AirPods. Okay, what do we have here? <laughs> On Revolt of the Empire of the Apes. This is. Oh, can I show this on YouTube without? Okay, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna do it. Revolt of uh what was it the revolt of the empire of the apes this is oh very nice this is going to be a uh planet of the apes style exploitation film earth has become the apes playground and humans are used for labor and sport well, sounds familiar right <laughs> not from society not from like the news but from planet of the apes movies uh the simians rule is threatened by a band of rebel freedom fighters led by old friends and enemies alike. Mankind's last stand will become a war of bloodshed, high explosive action, and excitement between humans and ape alike. The cage door has been opened, and the revolt started in this exciting sequel to Empire of the Apes. Also, this is the sequel to Empire of the Apes. Do I wonder if... Do I have to track down Empire of the Apes? I think I do. Okay, well, what else do we have here? Oh, we have... We have things... Which is, it's autographed. Mr. Sterling has autographed this. There's Mr. Sterling's autograph. Uh, let's see. Creatures created by the evil of men. Very cool. Um, let's see. 
Just trying to. No, I better not show you guys that. <laughs> That's pushing the boundaries for YouTube. I don't want YouTube to be like, um, Serial at Midnight. We have we have problems with the way that you have uh. YouTube is oh you oh YouTube. I was gonna say something that might land me in trouble with YouTube, so I'm not gonna do that. Things five. Let's see. Does this have a subtitle? Strange monsters. Um. Oh, this is Skullface Astronaut. How many of these are Skullface Astronauts releases? Just want to make sure. Uh, they're written and directed by Joe Sherlock. So uh, here's behind the scenes. Joe Sherlock sent me some of his... Uh, Joe Sherlock is another um, independent horror director. A lot of this, uh, you know, shot on video back in the day, kind of moving into the whole shot on digital sort of a thing now. Uh, he sent me some of his releases, and we're going to be covering them soon. It's just a matter of, you know, it's always a struggle to try to find the best time to cover what releases... And it's weird that sometimes these unboxing videos become the best place for that. We're going to be talking more about Joe Sherlock's uh, movies and the Skullface Astronaut brand. Uh, but anyway, this is Things 5 Strange Monsters. Uh, Sterling Entertainment and Skullface Astronaut present thing five, Things 5. I think, I think I can show you that. I think that's cool. Uh, and if it's not, then I, I think it's fine. I think it's fine. Very, very cool. Uh, this is a Blu-ray, right? Yeah, this is a... Let's actually... I haven't put it on the... Let's put it on the hub. Let's slap this baby on a hub. Oh, I should say, these are going to be... Uh, like, Blu-rays and stuff. These are going to be manufactured on demand. These are not factory... So far, these are not factory-pressed discs. Um, which I think most home video... Oh, this one's, this one's autographed as well. Back here. I think most home video uh, horror fans... Are used to that here as well burned on demand it's just just comes with the territory you know what i'm saying let me see this this dvd I'm curious to see now if this dvd it is also this dvd is manufactured on demand it has the purple it's got purple bottom you know what they say about a purple bottom i don't last in the box is oh the haunting of la llorona wow what is this um I'm looking for like a year. I don't see a year. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. The screams of the children echo through the night as Violet reminds. You know, we've covered a La Llorona movie. I think it was a Black Friday release. There's, you know, there's like a big budget La Llorona movie. And my game that I will invite you in on if you didn't see that video is you take the tune of my Sharona and you do La Llorona. So, doom, doom, doom. Okay, that's all I'm going to do. Fair use, YouTube. It's fair use. You stop it, YouTube. It's fair use. And you take that tune and you go, La Yorona. And then I have like a whole song. It's like, when you're going to take a my child, Yorona. Um, maybe someday I can do it on a live stream or something like that when I don't have like YouTube's algorithm searching, scrubbing through every video for usages of copyright infringement that they can swing down Thor's hammer upon me upon the independent youtuber trying to trying to make it's trying to make something man i'm just i'm just out here trying to make something man here is the haunting of oh wow we got like a lot of this is uh some production value right here guys we have like a a postcard with all of the the uh camp blood not all of them but a lot of the camp blood artwork what do we have the uh things fives on there la llorona's on there salvaging outer space that looks cool halloween horror tales blood donors i'm gonna have to look into salvaging outer space uh you know what there's an address for you right there if you want to look up uh, mr sterling's stuff but i will again i will link to, to uh, the the storefront in the description of this video once again burned on demand which is just how independent people got to do it you know what i'm saying so that is going to do it this is uh this is the haul from mr sterling we have uh these four titles three blu-rays and a and a dvd and i'm going to just drop he's not going to stay well he will oh hold on thumbnail let's see if i can get into balance long enough for a thumbnail do it you will axe grinder guy <laughs> okay I did it. Uh, guys, thanks so much for hanging out, unboxing some independent horror from Sterling Entertainment and Skullface Astronaut. 
Uh, stay tuned for more independent horror coverage, as always. Thank you so much for your time. Thanks to Mr. Sterling for sending this box of goodies. Uh, check out the sale and check out our past Sterling Entertainment coverage. Guys, thank you so much. Take care. And until next time, I will catch you <laughs> later. Bye.